we've just been working with Heartfelt Voice, um, an organisation we've partnered up with for the last year or so, and we um, work to bring Heartfelt Voice in today to do some heart checkups um, on Lancashire County Cricket Club staff. that the stethoscope is one of the earliest ways to diagnose heart valve disease. At Heart Valve Voice we say the more we listen the more lives we save. Hi. Hi. I'm Stuart. Oh, oh, okay my name's Mick. Nice to meet you Mick. Okay thank you. There's my okay. uh, doodah. Thank you very much. How are you feeling today? I'm feeling fine, thanks. Great. Yeah. So you take some tablets for blood pressure? I do. Okay. Any other medical problems? Uh, I'm asthmatic. You're asthmatic? Yeah. Okay. And that is part of my problem with my breathing, obviously. Yeah. I think from the age, I'm not too bad. Good. You know, I've been a fit person in my life because I've been in the building trade all my life. Yeah. You know, so that's, you know, been good stead, really. Good. Uh, so, what we're going to do today is a check of your heart to see whether you've got any signs of heart valve disease. And to do that, we examine your heart using a stethoscope. It should take about a minute or so, it won't be uncomfortable or painful, um, and we get the results straight away. Okay, okay yeah, you pop your, pop your shirt up. So this is a, an example of a normal aortic valve. Um, you can see it has three cusps, one, two, three. The cusps are thin and mobile. They open easily to allow blood out of the heart around to the rest of the body. Um, so this is what you would hope your aortic valve looks like. This on the other hand is a, an example of a diseased aortic valve. And you can see here that the uh, three, it still has three cusps, uh, but these cusps have become heavily calcified. So you get a buildup of calcium over the years. Uh, which causes the valve to become narrowed. You can see it's then very difficult for the valve to open, it becomes tight, uh, and this can cause a number of symptoms including shortness of breath, chest pain, and even collapse or faints. Okay, that's fine. Okay. Okay. Good. Don't have to Okay, right, thanks very much. No problem, it's all okay. the best. Okay, thank you. Thank you. Okay. Okay. Thank you. All right, bye. really important you should do it as long as you know about it you know people don't know about it do they have our voices working with healthcare professionals and patients to raise awareness of the disease but also to promote the use of the stethoscope at GP surgeries across the UK <laughs>